So today's video is about the improved clinch knot. Now this knot is going to be perfect for leader material straight to whatever your bait is. It could be jig heads, it could be top waters, it could be soft plastics, and it could be subsurface hard baits. Um, before we get started, I want to thank you guys for your support. I'm at 400 subscribers, and if you're not subscribed, if you would subscribe and like this video, it does help me show up in the YouTube algorithm. And as a thank you, I am going to be putting on a 500 subscriber giveaway. So in this giveaway, I'm going to have all of my favorite baits that I use you know, throughout the year. I've got my diesel minnows in pearl. I've got uh, another set of diesel minnows in red bone. And switching over to gulp, I have a pack of chartreuse pepper neon, five inch gulp sheds, and uh, another set of pearl white shrimp. And of course, you gotta have the head and super spook top water. And then a couple sets of uh, ice track fishing jig heads. And one is the redfish eye in 3 16th ounce, and the other is a set of three in the quarter ounce trout eye. Some of my favorite baits and what I'm using in all of the videos that I've created. Now, I'm gonna keep you guys in the loop on how we're gonna do this giveaway, but I gotta get 500 subscribers first. So let's get to the video. Thank you guys for tuning in. We're pretending this is the eyelet on my hook and this paracord is actually my braided line or leader material. Step one of the improved clinch knot is to run your leader through the hook eyelet. You're gonna leave yourself plenty of tag end. Step two is we're going to twist five times. One, two, three, four, five. Step three, we're going to run our tag end through this loop that we've created that is touching the hook eyelet. And step four is loop it back through the large loop that we just created. Okay, and then you're going, now because this paracord, it doesn't cinch very well but you're gonna grab and cinch down. And then of course, you have your improved clinch knot and you're gonna clip your tag in. All right, one little trick that I like to do with my, uh, my knots that I tie is to wet them with, with spit. And it's kind of like a super glue once it dries. It just helps keep everything together. But that's it. Thank you guys for watching.